This is Minecraft, but you can copy and paste anything. Today, I can literally cheat in Minecraft by using a new copy-paste tool that allows me to duplicate anything in existence. I can then use these newfound resources to craft crazy powerful custom items, from shields to blades and even worlds that I must use to defeat the plagiarizer himself. Hit that like button and subscribe, or else you could end up like this. Oh! <laughs> So click sub now, I want three million subs, please. All right, let's see here. We have two different items. One is an item copy paste tool and one is a block copy paste tool. So we'll obviously want both. It requires iron, diamonds, and gold. So we need to get that right now. And well, there's a jungle temple right in front of us. There might be some diamonds and goodies there. Who knows? Whee! Don't die, Grazer! Oh, jeez, Louise. All I do know is that I can't copy and paste until I do get these tools, so I need to get them fast. All right, dodge the arrows. Okay, well, that didn't work out. Let's see anything in here. Wow, literally the worst chests in history. Followed by, oh, one of the better chests in history. That's actually gonna give us our gold block right away so we can make that. Iron doesn't take too long to grab and then we'll be able to make one of the two tools. And oh my goodness, wow. It's a brown panda. Do you guys know how rare this is? Okay, hold on a second. Razor, everyone needs to leave a like right now or else. Oh, jeez, Louise, okay. 10,000 likes, guys, for the brown panda. I think that's worth it. I mean, this thing is incredibly rare. And lovely, we have a village. Any iron in the village? No, but lots of emeralds and lots of food, which is actually why I'm happy to have found this place because I need tons of food now. So we'll start digging straight down and hopefully I don't hit into anything really bad. I just want iron, okay? Oh, jeez. Oh, okay, Enderman right here. Wait, do we go for him right away? I think so. Let's risk it all <laughs> immediately. I need an Enderman. Pearl and remember guys we're gonna be able to duplicate no no holy smokes one heart oh yes get out of here zombie I'm gonna start grabbing all of this beautiful iron everywhere thank you and that should just about be enough to create the copy paster tool this is one iron block we just need a couple more and voila so if we go into the crafting book right here we are now able to craft the block copy paste tool it says click shift to know more right click on a block to copy it left click to paste it. Okay, I want this immediately. We're gonna test it on any like normal blog. If I click this, successfully copied andesite. Oh my goodness, I can place andesite anywhere I want an infinite amount of times. So all I have to do is find one diamond basically. Now remember, this only does blocks. The other one does items, which we can't craft yet. To make it, we would need a diamond block. So we need to actually make that ourselves because we can't duplicate items. And then we'll have both tools and we'll be able to get really overpowered and start to create all of these OP items like the pasteable shield. There's a copy and paste battle axe. So many cool things here that we're gonna be able to craft with our infinite resources. And there we have it, a diamond. You know what I just took in? We might not be able to duplicate diamonds themselves, but we can duplicate the diamond ore. So we can just make nine diamond ore and mine them and then we'll have a diamond block. So let me do that. Successfully copied the deep slate diamond ore and now I can just place them everywhere dude this is better than creative mode eight and nine and now we'll go in we'll make that diamond block and now we actually just need two more iron blocks again all right and here we go the item copy paste tool bam so now with this one well right click a dropped item to copy it left click to paste it so i'm gonna put all my diamonds out on the floor we want to copy these immediately successfully copy diamond and Woo! Oh my gosh, I can just throw diamonds all over the place. And with these first diamonds, I am going to go ahead and get fully geared because I don't trust myself in this warden zone. And I feel like if a warden does come out, I do need to have at least diamond armor because even if you have diamond armor, you're still not really that safe. I mean, this thing is super powerful and strong. So we've already duplicated all the diamonds we need. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do the ender pearl too, just so we don't have to worry about this later. We'll still need the blaze rods, but still. Give me infinite ender pearls everywhere. Thank you. A paste block doesn't look that hard to make though. We just need a lot of gold and diamonds, which I can duplicate right now. I'm kind of interested to see this. That is as long as we don't detect the warden, okay? Oh my gosh, no, 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 Okay, get out of here, Grazer, get out of here. The warden has just spawned, he is after you. I did not think I would ever actually spawn a warden. Oh gosh, he's running after me, dude. Oh, jeez, he just shot me with a laser, I'm half heart. Holy smokes, 
I think I got away. So let me go ahead and make all those diamond blocks we need for this paste block, as well as grab a gold block for the middle. And there we go, our first custom item, the paste block. I don't even know what this does. What's it gonna paste? We'll put the paste block down. What, do I right click it or something? What in the world? Where am I? A paste angel? Die, you stupid paste angel, take my diamond sword. Okay, it's not proving to be too hard, but I think we're like, yeah, we're way above the ground. So if she just smashes some of the glass below my feet, I'm going to fall like a thousand feet to my death. She's almost dead, <gasps> come on, yes. Okay, wait, 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 she dropped something. Holy smokes, we're high up. A paste ax, <gasps> what does this do? Write the name of the item you want to paste in the world. <gasps> wait a second, netherite ingot. No way, no way, gave one netherite ingot to Grazer. <gasps> oh my goodness, and now put this on the ground, copy it up and just Wrinkled netherite and gets all over the place. Realistically, I don't really know how to get out of here, so wish me luck. Oh my gosh. Please don't land on a piece of ice. Oh, jeez. Okay. We're good, holy smokes. So there we are, netherite block. And we just gotta surround that with a bunch of diamonds. Easy peasy, ah Let's see what this copy block is all about. Oh, I have no idea. Whoa, where am I? What the heck? What are these things? What are they wearing on themselves? Are they gonna drop that? Okay, wait, wait, I'm losing health now. They are dropping it. What kind of armor is this? Holy smokes, it's a copy chest plate, copy boots. Oh yeah, we don't even need netherite stuff. Holy smokes, it makes me invisible. And there are tons of gold blocks up the wazoo everywhere. Dude, we are getting so many resources. Okay, we need to look into more custom items though. And, oh, wait a second, you know what? If I use the paste ax, can I just do blaze rod and spawn it? Did it work? Oh my gosh, it did, yes! Okay, so we can at least create our Eye of Enders pretty quickly here. Let me go ahead and sprinkle these all over the place, pick them up, and bam, 16 Eye of Enders. We'll start making our way over to there, but we are not nearly powerful enough yet to take down this copy boss. We're gonna need a lot more stuff, and also, how the heck do I get out of this place? Whoa, whoa, oh, we're all the way up in the air again! Okay, and down we go! Alrighty, now I wanna replicate a bunch of redstone, and I bet you're wondering, you're like, Razor, why would you wanna use your superpowers on this? <laughs> well, because it allows us to create the error blade. Look at that thing. And, uh, well, we gotta get prepared for that copy boss in the end, so we gotta start making some insane weapons. Now, what does this thing do, you ask? Well, holy smokes, it just depletes blocks everywhere! Uh, does this thing have, like, any other powers? What else can it do? I think that might be it. Whoa! Oh, jeez Louise! No, 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 no! It definitely wasn't it! If we look up some of these items here, you'll see they require something called a copy-paste ingot, which is something we don't have and we can't get unless we beat a copy entity. And to beat a copy entity, we need to go to the copy world. There's too much copying going on right now. So how do we get to the copy world, you ask? Well, we have to create it using a bunch of saplings, diamonds, and redstone. So diamonds and redstone we have, and there we go, a sapling that we can just go ahead and copy and paste. And there here we go, we have ourselves a copy world. Let's go get these copy paste ingots immediately. I think I just have to right click it. Oh brother, there he is. Oh my gosh, it's the copy entity. I'm gonna see if I can drop one of these big weapons onto him. Oh, it missed him. Okay, I don't think I have something strong enough to beat this guy right now. Let me see if I can make another weapon real quick. Ooh, I wonder what a misclicked scythe is. Let's create this. Can we uh, defeat this copy entity with it? He's cloning too much. Whoa, what did I just do? What? I killed him! Huh. And there we have it. Tons of copy-paste ingots that we can now use to create new items. Whoa! What on earth is that? Okay, so everywhere I throw this thing, it creates a tornado that is literally sucking in every single block around it. Okay, we're gonna have to get rid of this thing or get out of here before we get sucked in ourselves. So the first thing we can make is called the clickerizer. If I use it, what happens? Whoa! Holy smokes! Oh, and everywhere I walk is now turning the ground into different, oh, hold on, error blocks. Oh my gosh, that's why, because I'm literally a mouse! I can go back and forth between being a mouse and my regular person, that is sick. So you could say that I'm a pretty uh, quality 
water resistant mouse. <laughs> That's sick. And the other item we can craft using these copy ingots is called the clicker. So it kind of looks a bit similar, but it does have its differences. It almost looks like it's some sort of infinity gauntlet thing. What in the world is that thing? Why is it putting lightning everywhere? There's literally mouse cursors all over the air. Okay, maybe that'll like hit like an enemy if there, if there was like an enemy around here, which there doesn't seem to be any. It also spawns this thing, which, oh my goodness, it lasers anything around it and kills it immediately. Okay, so we'll just keep that by this cave spider spawner. Goodness, look at this bow. That looks insane. What does this thing even do anyways? We have an abandoned village here. Uh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, loot. Oh, lots of good loot. Wait a second. We do need golden apples. I will take those. We're gonna, oh, yo, it keeps going and going. All right, next we need some obsidian. And instead of an obsidian mining session, we are going to have an obsidian copy session, baby. Give it all to me. There is this rainbow copy and paste battle axe I wanted to create, which is why we needed the obsidian, by the way. So we're gonna go ahead and I want to use it and see what happens here. Whoa. Whoa, what? Whoa, 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 what is happening? What is happening? It's got the creeper, just sucked the creeper inside of it. Why creeper? Hey, zombies, take my tornado. Oh my gosh, yo. That is so sick. All right, we will need a shield and this is a pasteable shield. So I will go ahead and create that really quickly. Make a normal shield and boom, pasteable shield. We'll go ahead and equip that just like so. Oh my goodness. The shield spawns a mega shield that goes ahead and just, oh, shoots the shields all over the place. And you guys know how much I love my blasters and we can actually craft two of them. We can craft the 404 blaster and the double error 404 launcher. So let's go ahead and get the 404 blaster. That thing looks sick. And we'll also grab the launcher. And what do these things do? There's a skeleton annoying me right now. Do I want to test this blaster on you? Oh, geez Louise, what just happened? It like launches me way in the air. What is happening? Why are there blocks flying? Floating everywhere. Oh my goodness! What did I just spawn? Oh, copy. Oh boy. Wait, do I have my own copy entity now? Hey, you copied me, copycat. Well, not really. And wow, those are. Oh, oh, geez Louise, now you're copying me. Get out of here, skeleton. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on? It's not stopping. It keeps getting bigger. Woo! Okay, it's gone. What else is it doing though? What is surrounding me right now? What is this force field? What does this do to a mob? Oh, it like glitches out as if a copy error happened or something. That's really cool. Goodbye, buddy. Oh, looks like the stronghold's right down here, Mr. Copy Mod. There is a couple more items I wanna create before we get in here just to make sure we win this battle, including this defected artifact, which requires a totem of undying, but one of the blasters when I used it spawned one into my inventory. So I think I was supposed to make that before making this one. And uh, Wandering Villager, do you have anything for me? Whoa, holy smokes. My shield also has a force field around it. All right, so I'll use the red laser. It'll start mining us all the way down to the stronghold. And I can just use this to do the rest. Oh, brother. Oh. Okay, it doesn't hurt me. It just blasted right through the stronghold though. I hope that didn't do anything. And it's so weird to see myself, but I did need redstone. Now we have all the ingredients. We can do the defected artifact. And I wanna see what on earth is it that this thing does that can help me. Oh, it puts a tear on my head. Wait. What is that? Uh, hello? It's a walking totem on dying. Oh my gosh, it literally does just fly with me. Okay, let's make sure my uh, weapons of mass destruction didn't totally ruin this end stronghold. We are good, thank goodness. We can go in and finally fight this boss. I'm gonna activate my shields. There's one more item I wanna make, but I'm gonna make it while we're inside. I think I'm as powerful as I can possibly be. Here we go. Look at this place, this is insane. Okay, I want my totem buddy here and I want my copy buddy as well. Let's see what I'm in for. Oh my goodness, is there two of them? One more item I wanna make. It's called the copy hammer. This thing I think will be able to single-handedly take down the plagiarizer all by itself. This is a powerful weapon. All right, Mr. Plagiarizer boss. Okay, so what does this ax do? Whoa, whoa. Holy smokes! Whoa, holy smokes! Yo, look at me on the copy hammer! This is insane! I can go anywhere I want! I'm just breaking through all the end, that's sick! Oh my gosh, I can spawn moving hammers around. What is this gonna do? Oh my gosh! It just killed the plagiarizer boss in one hit! Oh my gosh, I got rid of half the portal using my copy hammer already. Well guys, that's Minecraft, but you can copy and paste anything. And I will see you guys all again next time! Goodbye!